There you are. Come on. Keep walking. You're late. A couple of days in this place, you turned into some clock-watching city boy. What's the urgency? We need to leave. Forever. We've been doing well, making money. But for us all to leave together, we need enough for a boat. Now, I found a friendly ship captain. He's willing to take us to Australia or Tahiti. We just need to pay for passage and give him money for land when we get there. No questions asked. We will disappear. Be reborn. Well, where the hell is Tahiti? South Pacific. An untouched paradise. Who lives there? Tahitians, I guess. We made a bit of money on that riverboat job, but not enough for us to leave and live peacefully. Where's the rest coming from? In there. So we are gonna rob that place. Well, I didn't think we was fixing the plumbing. I don't know if you have noticed, but we are on the clock. I reckon we got a few days before the Pinkerton show, and then well, we're done. Now, we need money. Bronte said this place has got money. Come on. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robbery. Behave as I tell you, and none of you will die. Annoy me. And you all will. Now remember, all your money just now. Don't money. make me ask Don't twice. Don't make us kill you, Mr. F. Leave these fine folks of their valuables, Mr. F. Check that room back there. Now, I got I this one. Dying. That's your choice, not mine. Kindly open that gate and let my acquaintance inside. Give me your money. Please! You crazy? Open the gate and let my acquaintance. There's nothing much here. What? There's nothing really here. You're sure? Yes. Then get out here and get ready for company. All of you! Behave. We don't want to hurt any of you. Mr. M, check the safe. Sure. Open it. I don't think they keep much cash in there. Open it! There's almost nothing here. There should be stacks of cash in there. He told us there was. Look again. There's no stacks. A few dollars in coins. That's it. Damn! We got a problem. There's a ton of cops out there. We got you surrounded! That greasy son of a bitch! He set us up! You think? This seemed like a good time for sarcasm to you, Arthur. What are you gonna do, gentlemen? Something! The trolley. The trolley! Follow me, gentlemen! Go! Woo! Now! Go! Does this trolley go to Tahiti? I hope so. All right, shoot us some space. Look out on the right! Oh, we've been watching those side alleys, Arthur. We got someone about to be killed. Uh, that bastard must have called in every cop in the city. Some riders coming on this side. Arthur, cover our left, Lenny. Arthur, you need to help Lenny now. Come on, Arthur, hit this oh, wall already. Arthur, coming out of the bank on the left. Ah! Bronte has got a pay for this. Yeah. 
I think we're clear. You know what, Dutch? Next time, let's not damn discretion. Seemed like a good lead. I know, but... Well, we made it. <clears throat> thanks to you. Don't mention it. Yeah, you're a good kid. And we each got... $15. Oh, no. <laughs> and a quarter. Don't forget the quarter. Shut up, Arthur. He set us up. <clears throat> Played me like a yokel. Put the law on us. What did we do to him? What did I do to him? I guess he thinks he's the king around here. He don't want the likes of you. So, what are we doing next, Dutch? 
We just need money. One more decent take, and we're gone. The bank is our bet. Jose agrees. Even after that, especially after that. I don't feel so good. Now you just got a bash on the head. Come on. I'm taking you back to camp. Hey, you did real good there, Lenny. Just wish it could have turned out better. Well, can't win them all. 